Family Clarendon and under siege right now. Yeah. As new reports are coming out right now, two bodies has been found wrapped in a tarpy, ladies and gentlemen. Greetings, greetings, and salutations yeah, to all nation. Ladies and gentlemen, you know I'm Master Far Right Soldier of Deep Roots TV. Yes, and if this is your first time tuning in. Hey, Deep Roots, man. How you guys doing out there? We're having a good time, man. We're we running for a lot of little feet. The police on Wednesday has discovered two bodies in a Toyota Pro Box motor car in the section of Portmore, St. Catherine. May I tell you, say, St. Catherine, turn up. I said Clarendon earlier, but may I tell you, see, St. Catherine just cross certain way right now. May I tell you, say, six has been dead in the near Spanish town in a Tuesday time, you are going to You see, it seems like, say, the one other gang them have an internal feud. Now, the police are advising members of the public that use job lane and Spanish town in a St. Catherine as part of evening commute. To use alternary roads. This is because the crime scene for the investigations are being processed. Because the shooting took place alongside the road Tuesday afternoon. The shooting resulted in the injury of two people. Both are far not fatal right now. So far. However, a total of six fatalities were recorded in near Spanish town Tuesday. Including... The discovery of these two bodies a long time dirt truck in Makok Pen community outside of the old capital. Now, a member of the military was also reported shot dead at his home in Central Village outside of Spanish Town. And two men were shot dead when gunmen opened fire in the market district of Spanish Town with numbers of others being left nursing sh gunshot wounds. Then reports are that men were fatally shot by police in French Street, Yorgantine, in the area of Spanish Town there. Now, amidst it all, there was a fire at the administrative building in St. Catherine Parish Court. <laughs> a pier hell and mayhem going on there in a St. Catherine. The reports are emerging of numbers of roadways being blocked at the old capital. More details are to come as the story develops. But when I try to show you, say, the man them have got locked down St. Catherine, locked down Spanish town right now. Because it seems like the whole of Spanish town turn up serious. It's like we reached in the 80s again. Man, them block the road and abound the place. Yeah, I guarantee. Seems like the one other gang them a turn out wicked because what? The black man and the man they in a jail right now and the court supposed to a wrap up. Right now, a peer reprisal a go on in a Spanish town. The old gun town, De La Vega. Body dumping a cane piece never found. Ladies and gentlemen, this time are the times that we have to stay inside our house and stay away from scrupulous wretches. These are the times that you have to hold steadfast to your feet. You are going to tea and don't play like no beat. The man them quarantine and lock down the place. They are going to tea for two years. And now the people them get a chance to go out. And the bad man them is running rampant. Like the Spanish Tonian said. Chronics. A government inventing these crimes. You are going to tell where all these weapons coming from in Jamaica people. Uno nifi met me know where them are come from. It is unbelievable. The amount of gun crime that is being committed in my island, it's a shame. Them have the people, them overseas running scared and the local youths, them on the street wanting some safety. The government 
is pressing the people purposefully. And then they want the people to run to them, to ask them for help, while they snatch away the little, little rights, little civil and human rights. I hear all this talking to you about rights. What about the rights of the victim? What about the rights of the victim? The victims are not just the people that are being victimized directly, but the ones that are indirectly being victimized. We put you, Prime Minister Andrew Holness, in power to make a safer and a better Jamaica, but you continue to rule and lead in a way that the criminals continue to have an overhand. May I tell you, sir, we need a death penalty in a Jamaica from 2017. And you now listen, so I want the people them for vote you out, Mr. Holness, because I believe you're from Spanish Town, and Spanish Town is one of the baddest town. So I must fear your faction of bad man them. I heat up the place with the quen quen because election I come up. Don't think so Uno can fool all of the people all of the time. No, you cannot. Me not talk it for just a rhyme. Chronics keep telling you a government invent crime. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Rastafari, soldier of the Broads TV, reporting. There have been a barrage of gun murders in Spanish town since Tuesday. Over six confirmed dead. It is unfortunate now bodies are turned up in a toppy in a port more. Hit that red subscribe button ladies and gentlemen and leave your comment. Let me know what we could do to help solve greetings, the greetings. gun violence that yes, we are season, facing. Greetings. That's the real pandemic hey, in my island. Brothers killing brothers, brothers killing sisters. It is a folly. It seems like we have joined the team of the Unigenics. Unbelievable. We now stop killing each other like dogs in the street.